station, station, we believe in you. And that's for we come out of the studio right here, right outside in the street. That is right, man. And thank you for presenting me. Hi. I'm Bob, and I'm wearing ladies' underwear. And this is why this story personally affects me. At around, I'd say, 12 a.m. I would say about 1 a.m., Bob. <laughs> we can edit it, right? Yeah, 12 a.m. 12 a.m. And then, considering that we have no reliable sources anyway, we'll just say 12 a.m. It was, it was dark. Well, yes, unless we're in Alaska, but I think it would be dark all around the world. I agree as well, Bob. Anyway, back to the main story. Anyway, back to the main story. If you're a woman out there, beware of this young man. His name is... Can you please move out the way? Can we just please oh, present can him we present first? Him? Yes. His name is... Adam. What's his last name? Muhammad. Adam Muhammad. You're a bastard. <laughs> ben, what did we say about cursing on air? I'd like to say you're a fucking bastard. <laughs> That's better. You've got to forgive my, my, my friend here. He's uh, just recovered from Tourette's. So anyway, back to the Kim Banker case. Adam Muhammad. I love you. Later, okay? Later. I told, I told you, what, what is wrong with you? I can't help you. You've got, shh, shh, the lights on. And you've got to stop setting your roses. My wife is getting suspicious. What and wife? Anyway. <laughs> 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 Shut up. Anyway. Back to the main show. Back to the main show. Adam Muhammad, young, Pakistani. Uh, Pakistani. Yeah. It's all the same anyway. Um, you can only say that. Oh, I'm not allowed to say that? No, you are. You're the only one Adam Astrid can oh, say. Oh, yes, yes. I'm brown too, so <laughs> the racism doesn't work with me. Anyway, we young law student at here at the University of Kent. Her gear. Rebecca's over there. If you can please turn around, Ed Cameraman. He doesn't speak English very well. <laughs> <laughs> this is not her song, and you're very. Okay, that's enough of checking you out. Thank you. See, young. I'm very sexy, very young, beautiful, girl. like girl. Scarred forever by this. This man. This. This, this, this pervert. Terrible, terrible man. I, I like pervert. Mm. Then again, you like every pervert, man. I love you. <laughs> Sorry. I told you later. I what know. is wrong with you? Anyway, back to the main story. Back we, to the main story. We decided to help her, one of our key viewers. So what we did was we spunked his ride. <laughs> No, Isn't that right? no, no, we're not about to say that. Random people spunked his ride, <laughs> and therefore we find it that someone else, someone else, spunked his ride. Yes. And here is what we found. Move out the way. I mean, which um, ass? Let it not be can be confused with whipped cream, because trust me, I've tried it, and it doesn't taste too good. As you can see from the K and the. And you could see that this is quite quite professional work here. One might say it, it's a woman's work. I would say, I would say. In fact, if you see, look at the eye. It's too, too feminine. I agree. I think it's this top bit. It, it, it just it illuminates. A, ref a, refle a reflection? A ref you see, this is why I have sex with you every night. I see. You see? Yeah, anyway, back Sorry. to the main story. And if you come down to here, the word <laughs> thief. Spelled so elegantly with this with this like exclamation mark. With the exclamation mark. I didn't even know thief was spelt with an I. <laughs> and what I think is also quite key to this whole experiment, this whole thing. Please, please come come closer. Is I'm sure using my of course, using my own detective skill, I'm sure that a thong was once hanging on here. As you can see with the stains here. I'm not sure. Would you agree, Bob? Well quite frankly, man, I don't really see any stains. Well, well, Bob, I, I might have seen the people do it. <laughs> so maybe it was on the Bob, work with me. All right, we'll give you that much. Whatever, right? So if you move around the van. I, I've slipped in a muddle of shit. <laughs> so like your five divorces. <laughs> Quite metaphorically, yes. I see. I do not know what this person is trying to tell us. But what I am seeing. But what I think, in my professional opinion, is that this is an abstraction of the artistic perspective that was first formerly presented in the hood of the car. I agree, but I think we need some professional help from the Irish. I, I think that would probably help us. I would think so too. So. <laughs> <laughs> All right, now. If you look at the way back here, at this really, really crappy car, 
I think what we'll see is, we'll see and, some disgusting art. And if you fucking think about it, it's just wrong. It takes a really big wanker to drive this car. <laughs> and we look at it, it's a fucking piece of shit. It's a Rover 100. It's a fucking shite, you know? I mean, my, my dog can run faster than this shit. I, I mean, look, the only fucking thing that's keeping it together is a fucking bird shit on it. I know. And anyway, as you can see here. I think this was a man who did this. Because it's, it's sloppy. It's it lacks for nest. Bro, it looks like a fucking... Sperm stain, if you will. You gotta fucking excuse our cameraman, he's a fucking smoky McPuff asshole. I know, I'm scared. It's a fucking pain in the arse. Now, what would be good is if we bent down <clears throat> and really examined this properly. What we could find is. Right, right. What could we find? You know, it smells like a wee bit like cool wave, Gillette. It smells like sperm. <laughs> <laughs> I think one of our Irish people. Got it jigging. Because, I mean, this does look like one of our women from behind. <laughs> I don't know about that, Ben. I mean, I've never really smelt sperm. It's quite nice. <laughs> My wife smells it all the time. Right, but. I don't know. Overall analysis, right? I'd never if shout fucking, her. If you fucking think about it. Ever. I'm sorry. Right, you, you gotta fucking bring that up every fucking time. We're on fucking camera here. I'm sorry. Anyway, back to this. I don't know what to say. I think it's a disgrace of his car. I <laughs> think the art is amazing. I think it's amazing art. Just a wee bit, I think, just, you know, fucking artistic intuition here. I, I think what we need to do is just pause for this effect. Just pause. Just sh you know, silence. If you fucking think about it for a minute, it's, it's like This art. shaving cream, right? Represents us. And is noise. the fucking best thing that happened to this shite car. Best fucking thing. I mean, I'm talking about better than a fucking car wash. This piece. I'm sorry. I can't. Oh, see. look, fucking lovely <laughs> ladies. <laughs> oh, wait, wait. Yeah, oh, what a fucking one. Yeah, what we're gonna do is we're gonna creep up behind them. You take them from the right side. I'll take them from the left. And with this thumb, I'm gonna insert it up their butt. You mean the smelly thumb? Right. This thumb. Are you ready? Oh, it's gonna be a doozy. It's gonna be. A Flying dingoes everywhere. Flying dingoes okay. everywhere. On flying dingo we run. Flying dingo. One, flying, two. Uh, flying, dingo. <laughs> flying dingo. 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 Flying dingo.